Hello. I am Raja Kushal Najar. It doesn't matter to me how you pronounce my name. What is important to me is that you spell my name correctly because my first language is written English. Currently, I teach and run the IT program at Gallaudet University, the only university for the deaf and hard of hearing in the world. Gallaudet is officially a bilingual university using both written English and sign language with emphasis on visual accessibility and communication for the deaf. There is a diversity in communication, language and international presence. The importance is in building and connecting these different areas and communities. This is a huge part of how information is transferred from one place to another, where it contributes to both language and to culture. When promoting accessibility and equity, it is important to consider the diversity and differences in ability, language, and communication in these several different important and unique factors. By thinking about these factors, such as making people with different capabilities visual and promoting the thinking about the transference of information and experiences are critical and helpful ways to allow the deaf and hard of hearing and people who are dependent on visual accessibility to be included in the world as well as in the academic community. I would definitely recommend participating in that kind of relationship within the community. There's a strength in that relationship and participation, but if you stand alone, you'll fall. Does that make sense? If you're isolated without accessibility, you won't learn as much from others or benefit from those relationships that come from being within a community that is wholly accessible. Without that participation, there's no contribution to knowledge or common benefit to the people of the world.